You can't really dodge around the enemies too well, so that's not an option. So you spend a lot of time in combat with annoying fights. And when I say annoying fights, like, the, every one of these fights has some really stupid gimmick, like... These guys poison and they hit hard. That's annoying. The mermen hit really fucking hard and they poison. Here goes. The skunks are really fast. They don't poison, but they double hit, they crit often, and they also uh, heal themselves when they hit you. The tree ants just hit hard, as far as I know. I haven't fought too many of them, but they're annoying. Here goes. You can't handle this. All right. So ideally. Hey, he leveled up though, so we got all his MP back. Excellent. Can we? Okay, so there should be one right there. I think there's actually. You know, I'm not even gonna bother. I'm just gonna go back downstairs and back up. There's no reason not to. Might as well get the drop on them if I can. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Okay, let's try this. Let's okay. Well, I at least fucked up one of them. I will kill this guy. Okay. This dungeon is pretty rough. On the bright side, I feel like we're getting close to being done, though. Okay. How are we looking on skill points, though? At least we're getting a ton of skill points. Alright, so I need 212 skill points, 112 more. That's like four fights in this place, so... So there was a sunken path over here. Is it risen now because of the, uh... No? I, I, somehow they just randomly tell that I'm there and turn around. Alright. I love when that crits and does like a thousand plus damage. At least nobody got poisoned. Okay. I'll crush you. And fire. That's right. I did it. All right. All right. All right. So there should be a path. Okay. I think this is the path. This is, this is new. Maybe. Can we go up here? Is this, is this all new? Okay, well, there's a treasure chest there, so we gotta fight this. Don't scare now. In okay, well, I tried. How's this? 
None of them died. Alright. Well, he also poisoned, so we may as well take him out. Take this. That actually went surprisingly well. Okay. We're done here. Ooh. All right. There can't be too much left of this dungeon, can there? Like, aura mask. What the fuck is an aura mask? What's that do? Avoid enemies for a limited time. Alright, we might have to make use of that on the next floor. Alright, let's get this aura mask item I use. Let's see how this works. How limited is the time? Uh, yes, they do chase you. Let's just leave me. It's underwater path that does not seem to be have any ripples in the water when I walk through it. Ooh, treasure chest. A will amulet. Okay, what does that do? Increases the player's will. What does will do? Who is the lowest will? You have 33, you have 76, you have 49, 41, 50. Okay, well, we'll give it to the main guy for now then. I don't know what will does in this, so, yeah. Also, we're gonna save our game here. Also, welcome back, Faye. Hello! Yeah, enemies move, they chase you, they will fuck you up if they get you. Because they are horrible bastards. This is one rough dungeon. Oh yeah, he saw me. Can I get through here? No enemy here. Good, good. There's probably an enemy here. There's no enemy there. Weird. I'm a little worried now. I'm gonna use our second last tent. We got one more. Definitely a little worried now. Okay. Oh, we do want to save. I'm gonna have to invest in some uh, tents. Oh, there's no enemies here either. Okay. Interesting. Uh, is this what we're looking for? The water, water of life. This is it! The water of life! Great! Let's hurry back to Ganon get, uh, get, get and Village. Ooh. Sure! Okay, good. It teleported me out. Let's save the game again, just in case. Okay, that dungeon was... That was... Holy. Alright. 
It's a good thing I like the combat in this game because that that was that was something else. She fucked him up. Your fate. I guess I'm glad I saved up and bought all these weapons yesterday because they're really helpful. Hang on a sec, guys. Sorry, Bailey was up on a table she's not supposed to be on. So I had to tell her to get off the table. She listened. We're done here. Alright, let's check our skill points now that we're out of that place. So I need 212. Let's just pump all of them in there now. Yay, we're down to need 32. And then we're gonna uncover this one to determine what this one is. Alright. Yeah, everything in this game costs so much. It also doesn't help that the game is just like randomly like. Oh, by the way, you can't use the inn in any of the towns coming up, so... And by towns, I mean the town and the monastery. They have tanky bastards. You guys hear that? That's how they handle business. I've got 20 SP from it though. I need to fight one more. Look at the gems though. There are a lot of gems here. Glorious. We're gonna skip by most of these fights, but uh I just want to get uh, 32 FP so I can learn uh, whatever ability I'm planning to teach him. I like how I'm like vastly over leveled on these guys, but they're still able to do a ton of damage to me. This definitely harkens back to the day when uh, you had limited resources in dungeons. Okay, now that that's gone. What is this one? Sanctuary. Full heal, cure, and immunity for all allies. Killian Gelts at Salora. Combination. I guess we're getting the Salora. Alright, this is the next one we're doing. Jobs, jobs. Oh, no, I don't want to tempt fate. Tempt fate is this ability. It either heals, full heal, or you lose fifty percent of your HP. Oh yeah. Oh, he's dead. All right. That's quite the gamble. And they for it. He's dead. Alright. Well, we're gonna... not go out of our way to fight all of these guys if we can help it. Alright. 
I feel like I'm not getting any stronger though. Like I'm still getting the same amount of roughly damage. Actually, the, the only one I feel like is getting stronger is uh, is his magic. That's why I'm the best. It's magic hour. All right, oh, let's fuck this guy up. It takes three of us to kill this one dude. Take this. And then she can finish off this guy. Take this. That's the way it goes. Yeah, Geltz and um, Spinel are really close to another level, so that's good. I get stuck in another fight before I get to the next area. No, okay, good. I need to go down here. That's not good. If we stick to the road, we might be okay. Yeah, we're actually gonna try and skip enemies for this time. Especially in the desert. I don't want to fight any wolves. Wolves suck. Wolves are fucking assholes. Speaking of wolves. Oh, yeah. Taste my blade. All right. Boom, all right, she should hopefully be able to kill it. There you go. Oh, those, ro those wolves are rude. I don't like them. All right. I don't want quest, I want skill. You, I want to learn this ability. All right, that teaches him cleanse, so he can also use cleanse eventually. But for now, we're going over to you. You got 100 as your highest. 110, 80, 100. We're going to learn that one, probably. Or one of these ones. Yeah, 120. So we got to teach her that one. And then that one. All right, so we gotta save up 120 and uncover one. Shit. This time we got wolves again. Oh, yeah. One of these days I'll succeed and actually uh, confuse one of these fucks. Let's have a good attack. Loser. Damn. Fucking hell. <laughs> what, you're still alive? How? This? I got this. Like, he doesn't even have anything left in his health bar, and he's like, no, I'm still gonna fight. We finally reached it. We're finally here. Let's save before I go into the village. Ooh. Man, it's already 3.30? What the fuck? Time flies when I'm playing a game like this. Alright, well. 
Used water of life. So this is the water of life. Thank you. Thank you so much. I know my grandma will be better in no time. If you need us, or if you need to use our inn, just step outside and re-enter, please. I'm just glad we were able to help someone in need. Step outside and re-enter. <laughs> ah, fuck. So you are the ones who found the water of life for me? Thank you so much! But I still can't let you stay for free. Business is business! <laughs> Karma must be slacking on the job again. Alright. Better go over here to this house and see what's going on. Is there going to be a boss fight here? Please, please forgive me! Huh? What was that? Something's going on in there. Where Sp Spinel and Sex really, really right? You completely cracked the future of Ganelon. What the fuck are those? Oh my, Domingo. You told people about the Master's identity again, didn't you? N no, I didn't say anything! Domingo, don't you know by now that you can't lie to us? Please forgive me! You've been talking to me like this for five years! Forgive you! <laughs> You must not understand me. Maybe you need a reminder of what I am. Ugh. What are those creatures? Let's help him. Follow me. All right, Ludwig. What the? They're gone. What just happened? What in the world? They're gone. How? Was it all an illusion? No, they're still here, but you can't see them without the mirror mo of moonlight. In one of the monastery's old books. Why do we need a mirror? The mirror reveals all. You'll be able to obtain true sight with the mirror, yes! The mirror of moonlight. There's a guy in Habsburg that makes mirrors. Yeah, but he was saying we needed a specific one. Did you see a mirror of moonlight in his shop? Let's head for Habsburg. What? Why does anyone think my points are valid? We must talk to this mirror maker and see if he can come. Uh, uh, can help us. Come on. Might be able to get some new gear there. Fine, just ignore me. Whatever. Oh, shut up, Henson. Let's just go. All right, we're on to finding the mirror of moonlight now, guys. I'm gonna replenish my uh, supply of uh, medium potions. Or not. Unfortunately, I still have to spend 12,000 on another uh, five tents, but honestly, I think it's worth it. The tents ended up being super useful in that dungeon. Okay, we're going back to Hadsburg. Uh, that's the place we started today's stream. So far, this has ended up being quite the quest. I think that would actually die. Alright. Crit. No, I only did two. Weird. Give it up. I'll crush you. <laughs> hey! Gelt leveled up. Cool. What's those two fights? How many skill points do I have? 74. Okay. And yeah, she needs 120. So, you know, we need a 40, 46 more. 
We run into a fight, we run into a fight, but uh, I'm not going to be seeking them out here on the way. I'm just going to try and get there as quickly as possible. Mostly because the EXP here is not all that great, actually. And like, yeah, I, I need the XP, of course, but if I'm going to be fighting things, I want the EXP to be good, too, because I want to be able to level up. That only makes sense to me, at least. Hey, yeah, I confused him. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, this he crit his buddy, and then I got crit. Alright, pretty sure these guys were weak to fire. Take this. Why does my third dude look like Captain Picard? Uh, cause this is what Captain Picard, uh, did in his spare time. This is actually a story of, uh, him on the holodeck. <laughs> yes, I mean, this is a, a, a Korean RPG, it's not actually a gay RPG, which, uh, I'm liking it so far. They, they did a really good job, um... Only a few minor complaints, like that dungeon there, uh, was full of uh, enemies that kind of overstayed their welcome. But otherwise, it's, it's really good. Okay, he is nothing new for me. So we might actually be able to find some... I might be able to find some good accessories in the, uh, in the, uh, item shop. So far, there doesn't seem to be too much difference. There are some, uh... Stylistic differences. It definitely ramps up a lot faster than most JRPGs I've played. Um... Like, it starts off with enemies hitting really weak, and you get a ton of EXP, and then it slows that down considerably, and speed and ups the damage considerably. Welcome! What can I do for you today? Don't let me get in your way, feel free to look around. Alright, so I can get a health amulet. Increases maximum HP. So, I'm thinking... Having a mana amulet and a health amulet can't hurt. Having a might bracelet and an agus bracelet can't hurt. Okay, so, first... I want you to use the, uh... There you go. There you go, I'll give you that. Now he's got more defense, so... I'll give you the health one, so that now you get more health. That's what's been coming to our high prices. They got it all wrong. Alright, William, what do you got? We have people cleaning the vents, so that's air ducts in your house. 
Man, oh my god, I keep getting people calling me, telling me they're from Air du some Air Duck company, and they're really hard to heat listen to because they like talk in really thick, thick accents, so I have to keep being like, what are you trying to say to me? And then I have to tell them that I don't have any air ducts for them to clean because it's a condo and I don't I don't have control over that. Seven thousand gelders, sick. Welcome. I actually think it's a scam. Personally, they're looking to get access to your house so that they can see what valuables you have. Give them your valuables. Engelhide. Killian, I didn't expect to see you here. Engelhide? This is kind of a surprise. What are you doing here? The, the prince and I are old friends, so I dropped by. But it's good that you're here. This is perfect timing. I need someone to pick up a gift I forgot to get for the prince. I forgot to get it, and it'd be rude to leave now that I'm here. That's the spirit. That made you su su such a highly ranked graduate. Apparently I dropped some treasure in the backyard of St. Gurgis Monastery. It may have been buried. You know those crazy monks always burying stuff. It's of the utmost importance that you keep all this a secret. I don't think the prince would understand this little mix-up. So the gift you dropped is buried behind the monastery? Shh, not so loud! Find the gift in the monastery's backyard and give it to him. It's easy work. I'm sure a fine shepherd layer like you can handle it, no problem. This doesn't sound right, but I'll believe you. Mm hmm? What brings you here? If you don't have a reason to be here, please be so kind as to leave. I'm trying on a new wig for my wig. How many times do I have to tell Sally not to let those traveling merchants into the house? Free. Well, the moment I tell them I don't have any air ducts and that I've spoken to them like 75 times, they immediately hung and hang up. They don't say anything else. It's like, yeah, okay, you can't make it any more obvious you're a scam. Thomas, the finest mirror smith in the land, at your service. Alright. This may be the last 30 minutes of today's stream, guys. 